Hey ya, Mr. Jake 786 back again with another Friday the 13th game video. This time we have the single player challenges, actually. Um, they released today, and this is uh, the 10th level, actually. Made it off stream. Level 9 was really ticking me off, and I'd been streaming for like 3 hours, so just kind of gave up. Came back, refreshed. I did level 9. I'll, I'll try it again and record it for you guys. If that's something you want me to do, like, I know some of the kills are pretty tough to get. This one I just completed flawlessly. I'm not going to worry about the lights out, you know, hitting the generator box in this one, because all it does is freak them out. So right here I just want to show you how to do this cleanly without being detected. I got all three skull objectives on this one. So you just want to go after Vanessa first. She's pretty much, you know shooting fish in a barrel here. It's so easy to get her at this point. Right here, I'm just looking at the grab. Just looking at that new grab animation. I like how accurate it is and how he lunges forward. It kind of makes more sense and feels more natural than the spinning around and missing with the grab all the time. That was getting frustrating. I mean, it is a little frustrating that he can't, excuse me, he can't grab like in a radius around him anymore but he can just grab forward which is all you need really this nice little homage to that great kill we all know it I love some of the kills in this and the homages that they paid in this really good really good kills so here we go you want to shift back over to the house real quick you always want to like stalk through these windows they give you just that little extra 10 points. And I think they trigger things to happen. I don't know. Let me know if you had that experience yet. But uh, I had Bugsy at Pinehurst. He wouldn't trigger a certain action. He wouldn't go outside unless I stalked through the window. And when I didn't, he wouldn't go outside. So I guess they really want you to stalk. This is an easy one. You kill the Tiffany twin. Again, more homage stuff. Really like this level. Took me quite a few tries to get this one down. But I finally got it. Here I just go for a whatever kill. One of those default kills. Just go for it. Because there's nothing special. It's just kill her before she goes home. Is the objective. And then you want to set your sights on wherever the heck Kenny is. Because Kenny will go through the basement sometimes, or sometimes he'll go through the front door and go check on Vanessa. So that's what you want to do. Kenny being rejected by one of the Tiffany's is on his way to go check on Vanessa and see if he can somehow salvage the night. Little does he know, Jason has already stabbed Vanessa furiously through the raft. But let's see how this plays out. This is what you want to do. Grab him. Get this environmental kill. And the other place that he'll walk to is the campsite that I was near at the beginning. You can actually put his head in the fire at the campfire. And that'll give you more XP. So here... Make your way back to the house again. Go check these windows. You'll see Adam and Deborah getting ready to get frisky for the night. Oh yes, adult content. Are you calling it a night? Are you taking a single room? Calling it a night? Hmm. So you stalk this, La Chapa comes down, proud of his performance, bragging to Chad, and he's off to get the corkscrew, which I'm so glad finally they put this kill. Here you go through the basement, 
because the front door chads there and people keep seeing you if they go through the hallway upstairs they can detect you sometimes the walls feel like they're made out of uh what do you call it like tracing paper because people will see you right through them even from upstairs people were seeing me i don't know how uh, i'm pretty sure it's a bug but it is what it is they'll have to fix that garbage but here is my most favorite kill one of them from the movies probably the most iconic from this movie from part four there we go got he got crisp and glovered so i go back through the basement you don't want to go through the main uh living space go stock again Stock this window. Get that extra 10 points. Now, you want to go sneak up behind Chad. But you want to be careful. Because Deborah is moving around upstairs. Adam's moving around upstairs. I've had Deborah come down and see Chad dead if I killed him before I did the Crispin Glover kill in the kitchen. So you don't want to do that. You don't want to kill Chad first. You want to kill La Chapa first. Then again, I don't know what works and what doesn't work all the time because this game is so bugged. Again, <laughs> the single player challenges. Can you believe it, folks? Can you? Would you believe me if I said that they were bugged? Okay. Here, you want to be careful because you're, you're getting towards the end here. And you'll see I, I start to run out of time and it just adds to the tension. Here is the tricky kill. I'm searching these rooms. Well, I'm going to search these rooms very soon. Right here, I just feel like Tiffany's probably going to be here. And luckily enough, she was there. And you can get this window kill right here. you got to drag her over and see the two-minute marker starts coming up. Here we go. Awesome job. Love how they were able to get that, get that kill in the game, finally. They really need to put that in the main game. <laughs> but I guess it kind of makes this special. And now here, I hear the door opening and shutting over and over again. And I'm pretty sure that's just Deborah being glitched out again. So, I'm running out of time here. I make a quick decision. Well, I guess I'll just shift grab her real quick before I can get the undetected. So let's see. Let's see if I'm able to do it. Am I able to do it? Well, you probably already know, or else I wouldn't have uploaded it. And I get her. So that's what you want to do if, if it plays out like this. Glitched. And then the last one. You go across the hall. And you go get Adam. I don't think it's this one, is it? No, it's the next room across the hall. You go here, you get Adam. And you toss his ass out the window or something. But yeah, there you have it. Let me know your experiences so far with this mode. I think it's good, it's got a lot of potential, but it's bugged. And there we go, I got all three skull objectives. It's bugged. It has its issues again. It's not perfect. Jason, mother is you see, I got the Find them. different emotes unlocked. Okay, well, let me know if you want more of these videos, guys. I know it's new. Thanks for joining the stream earlier, those who did. And we'll be playing more of this again if you want me to. Let me know. Bye-bye.